Hi, um, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to all of my viewers out there. Welcome to the video. So the thing here is we're going to try and create a website using AI. You heard me right. This is another AI video because AI is a thing now. It's the trend. It's everything that's happening around us already. So might as well ride the wave, right? Now we're going to use AI or we're going to utilize the AI on creating a website. So for all the freelancers out there, for all those um portfolio uh, builders out there this may help you out so in total i have four websites for you guys to check on and again we're just going to create an account and just browse to the basics and then we can just make another video for about this on the future uh, videos that have a more detailed um on how to build the websites more specifically okay so before we get started i want you to get a piece of paper a notepad on your pc that's perfectly fine even your phone is good as long as you can take notes and follow those steps accordingly. Let me just check my recording here to make sure everything's good. Perfect. So the first thing I want you to do is, of course, build your um, website is to open your browser. I'm using currently right now, I'm using Microsoft Edge. And if you have a Google Chrome on your end, that's perfectly fine. Um, Safari is also OK. Actually, every browser is OK as long as you have access to the Internet. OK. So let's get to it. So the four websites are first is Haleya, second is Hocus, uh, please correct me if I'm pronouncing it wrong, um, third is Pineapple Builder, and then third up is probably fourth is going to be Clip or Clape. I'm very sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. Anyway, let's try Leia first. For me, um, I tried all of this already, and personally, Leia is the most user friendly for all those beginners out there. I suggest you try layer first and then walk your way through all these other websites. Okay, so once you're here, click get started and make sure you have a uh, active Gmail account on hand right now that you can access. Because it's actually very important that you have a Gmail account for verification purposes. So what's here is going to be, please enter what kind of business or organization you are. Let's just say, for example, Yoga Studio. And then... Okay, I have a few questions. Do you want to answer them or let me guess? Since this is an AI, we can just click just build my site and let the AI build the website based on the question earlier. For, remember the first question is about what type of business we have or something like that. The AI is going to base um, the design based on that answer and then build the website based on that. However, if you want a more detailed and more accurate design, I suggest you click on ask me questions. So give me a website name. Let's just say, since this is a yoga studio, yoga pants, something like that. Okay, do you have a slogan? If so, enter here. Best yoga pants in the country. Um, I'm not saying that you should copy whatever I'm typing here, of course. You need to put whatever you have on your end, what's the name of your shop, and what's the specifics on your end. So choose a domain. If you already own a domain name, you can change it to this to layer. So yogapants.site.live, click on next. Will your site have a place for users to buy products or book services? So the question here is, it's just asking if, are we going to sell something or we're going to sell products? We can either click product services, both or no. But since we're building a website and I'm a freelancer, I'm going to click on services. Do you want an about section? Of course, that's very important. Again, you don't have to follow whatever I'm doing here to the T, but I'm just showing the basics on how to create this and how to navigate layer. But of course, please follow whatever preference you have. So second question is, do you want a feature section on your page to highlight a few bullet points about what you do? Click on yes. Do you want a place to display a few photos? I'm going to click on yes again. Do you want a place to show some testimonials? Of course, that's very important. Again, do you want a place to highlight some of your team members? I'm going to click yes. So do you want a form for people to contact you with a more detailed message? Of course, that's very important for feedbacks. Do you have a logo to upload? If so, do here. If not, hit next. If you have a logo for your brand, you can just click browse right there and then just upload it over. If not, just click on next. And then do you have a website with some text we can use? If so, Enter the URL here. If not, leave it blank. Again, click on next if you don't have. 
I have enough to build a good looking site, but do you want to answer some more questions? So since we have a few more websites here, I'm just going to click on no here. But if you want to expand more, be more specific, of course, I'm not going to stop you there. Click this one if you want more specifics, okay? So I'm just going to build my website right here. Please continue. And then, I'm not a robot, of course. Click email. So here's the part where it's very important to have an active email. Give me a second here. I'm just going to use my um, dumb email. I'm very sorry about this. Give me a second, guys, okay? I want to make sure I have the right one because they're going to ask for a verification code. So building a website then shouldn't take more than a minute or two. Let me just check my recording again. If everything is good, perfect. View it. So this should be our website for Leia. And then give it a few seconds. Again, please take note I have the yoga pants URL that I typed earlier. And then it's on edit mode right now. It's going to be edit site. You can save it later on by clicking this logo right here. Okay? Give it just a few seconds to load. While waiting here, we can just move over here and log in while we wait for um, Leia. So here, it's going to be called Hukus. It's another AI builder site, same as Leia, but this is a more, a bit more complex than Leia because for me, Leia is the more user-friendly. Anyway, since we're here, click our email. Create my website. Easy as that. Again, please make sure you have a very valid email because they're going to need verification about that later on so you won't have any or you won't experience any trouble uh, when you try this tutorial by yourself. Okay? So search to find a theme that matches your profession. What is our target market? What is our store? What is this, our product? So since this is a tutorial video, I'm going to click on courses. And then I'm going to click on Give me a second. How to videos here. I think it's not here, but I'm just going to get a golf course right there. And then you make it look easy. Give me a second. Now tell us what you want to do with your website. This will help us create the tools and pages that you need. So we're just going to sell products, get new customers, get bookings. You can click everything actually. But for now, I'm just going to get sell, sell customers. I'm sorry, sell products and get new customers. So this is how we navigate Hookus again. It's very simple, right? It's basically just the AI is giving us everything we need. So tell us where business is physically based. This is the address only. So let's just say online business only since I'm working from home. Now, I think the first site is finished. Let's check it out. So this is our website. Give me a sec. I'm just going to skip these tips. So as you can see here, you can really manually edit it as you may. It's just like Canva, edit text, edit the placing. And it's really perfect. Even the AI chose the image for you. You can even edit it later on just by clicking the edit site and then going through these tools right here. For example, this is the mobile view, read the design, save changes, of course. This is the save changes of your website. Change color, domain name, and then website security, and so on and so forth. As you can see here, it's a pretty neat looking website. So again, personally, I suggest just use um, the layer, the site earlier, to create your website for beginners and then just walk your way through these other websites. Okay? So you can choose the name of your existing website. I'm just going to say Yoga Pants again to emphasize the first uh, website. So select highlight three unique aspects of your business. We will generate more customized content based on your selection. Let's just say, um, say it as it is, loyalty programs and exceptional customer service. Say it as it is. Again, guys, please, you don't have to follow me to the T. You can just put whatever you need there. For example, um, if you have a specific name for your business, you can just input it there. You don't have to follow whatever I click here. I'm just showing you how to navigate it, okay? So how would you like your website visitors to contact you? Of course, through phone or email address or webcat, website contact form. I'm going to say that says that. And then create my website. Now let's just give Hukus a few moments and then let's jump into the next one. It's going to be called Pineapple. Actually, this is a paid website, but you can try it for free, I think, for a month. And then make sure you need to 
cancel it before being charged automatically. You can check the pricing right here, but we're gonna, we're gonna do that. We're just gonna try now for free. Okay, so what are we looking for again? It's just the same questions on the two websites. Do you want to know what are we? What is our target market? What's the product we sell? What's our business technically? That's what they want to know. So from here, what are we looking for? I'm going to say digital shop. Did something that's not here. Actually not. I'm just going to click on next. So what is our main goal? Get appointment, sell services, and then click on next. I want to go back again for a few seconds here. So as you can see here, you have a few choices. But you have another choice right here that, for example, you don't have that target market on here, on their choices. You can just put it here. For example, let's just say cooking or something, selling pre-loved clothes or something like that. If it's not here, just type it right there, okay? So what's our project stage? Looking for inspiration, having idea. I'm just going to say growing business right there. So we have website samplets. So this is the few websites that you can try for free, I think. Let's just try this one. Okay. And right now we're on the edit page. I'm very sorry about that. So right now this is how it looks like. This is how it will gonna turn out. You can just edit it one by one. For example, the darkness, the color, the text style, the bottom style. It's really up to you. Your limit is only your imagination. Okay? Click on next. AI copy this is gonna be chat GPT 3.5 or 4 for the paid version. But you can use GPT 3.5 for free. So it's technically GPT is aligned with this website. That's why I set them up on this order, because this is the easiest, second easiest, third, and then actually this is the hardest for me. But pineapple is actually very accurate. Because it's aligned with ChatGPT. So let's just say landing page design for a yoga pants store. Easy as that. Target audience, let's just say yoga uh, instructors. Start generation. And as you can see here, it's being generated by ChatGPT. At the same time, uh, Pineapple is doing the design itself. So the context is from ChatGPT. But the design and build is from Pineapple. It's pretty slick. It's pretty smart, actually. And I love it. But for the beginners out there, you don't have to rush this one. You can just start on Leia. So this is the description from ChatGPT that we got from the title we clicked earlier. So if you're done here, you can just skip or stop generating. Because right now, um, Pineapple or ChatGPT is still generating our website from top to bottom. It's pretty good, right? So let's just check the last website right here while waiting for it to finish. So here, let's just get started for free. It's named Clip. So search for business. Again, it's the same question for the last three websites. Let's say freelance marketer for this one. And now, grow your sales is my second option. What's the name of your business? I'm going to say Yoga Pants. Click on next right there. Add some information about Yosna. I sell yoga pants. Again, you don't have to copy my uh, context here. It's pretty basic. I'm just going to show you how it works. You can just put your information out there to be more specific, OK? So add more content to your website. You can add address here, phone number, your logo or picture of your choice, even your social media. You can link them, OK? Make sure you click on that one to link in your social media. So this is actually the edit page of our uh, website builder and clip right now. Please wait, the AI Smiley team are building your page. So why did I put clip on the very last um, order among this website? For me, it's less, it's because it's hard for me and it doesn't have GPT um, inclusion, not the same as this pineapple right here. So for me, this pineapple website right here is the perfect website builder for AI. And then the easiest is Leia. Okay. So I think it's done here. You can click next. And then you can just sign in to get that website. You can sign in using Google, Facebook, or GitHub. Okay. You can just download it from here and out using Google account. Again, make sure you have an active Gmail address from here. Okay. 
Let's try resigning in on my dummy account. Give you a second. Now let's go back to Clip. It's still waiting to finish since it doesn't have a chat GPT connection. It's uh, making the description based on whatever I said earlier by itself. So let's just click on that one. And then company name. Let's just say yoga pants. Company icon, you can just click on that one. Now I'm going to create it. So what would you like to call your website? Yoga pants. Something like that. Click on next. Now team created, template, pages successfully created. And right now, ladies and gentlemen, this is our website. I hope you had fun. I hope you learned that the best for you, what's the easiest. And personally, this is actually still the best for me. Even though it doesn't have that chat GPT connection. It's pretty basic. It's pretty user friendly. But you wanna, if you want to take it to the next stage, be more specific. I suggest going to Pineapple. Okay? So clip is already done here. You can publish right after. And then you can design here. The text, the font. But for me, it's not that good. Not the same as Pineapple right here. Right? Anyway, you can edit still. Whatever you want to place here. And then click save and publish. So those are the four websites that you can create a website using AI. I hope you had fun. I hope you learned something. And thank you so much for watching. Have a great one. Please hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you.